Here's Michelle. Uh, temperatures in the 20s. Last day of the month. What's Monday looking like? It's looking quiet, but chilly. All Having right. the feel more of, say, January or early February rather than the end of the month. At this point, our average high temperatures are in the 40s, but we're not going to get anywhere close to that today. In fact, most of us won't even break 30 degrees. We're not too far from that number at the moment, but colder air is coming in now behind a front that came through last night. So 22 degrees in Smithfield. It's 25 in Providence and Newport, also in the middle 20s. Feels a good 10 degrees colder than that, though, when you add in the winds. They're out of the northwest and will be between about 10 and 20 miles per hour this morning. Going to keep our wind chill running very, very low in the uh, daytime today. Our threat tracker, though, is in the green. There's no big storm systems over the next couple of days. So, at least in the early days of March, it's not coming in like a lion and coming in actually with some more seasonable air. To New Bedford, we've got dry conditions out there, still some snow to melt away. Really hard packed at this point. We did have a couple of snow showers that came through earlier in the night around 11, 12 o'clock. We may have a little dusting of snow in a few communities, Pawtucket, East Providence. See a little bit of that dusting as we look right now at our live radar. It's all back to dry conditions. Lots of sunshine in store for today. But again, brisk and chilly. Temperatures at 8 o'clock around 21, 10 a.m. temperature 22. And in noontime today, only 25 degrees. This afternoon's highs between about 25 and 30. It does come with lots of sunshine, but those winds will be busy. The air cold and dry heading into this evening. As far as this afternoon's highs go, uh, it will be mildest along the coastline. 29 degrees in Narragansett, 28 in Westerly and Wickford. Newport in the upper 20s. Notice a little colder north and west of Providence, Boroughville, Situate, Coventry. You're in the middle 20s. Providence at 27. Sunny but cold with northwest winds at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Seekonk. Fall River and New Bedford all staying between about 25 and 30. So these are the numbers. The wind chill you want to dress for as you head out this morning. Feeling like single digits at 7 o'clock in the morning. Two in the afternoon. Wind chills between 15 and 20. And that's right, right around where we'll be heading into the evening hours as the winds start to die down. Now the early part of the night is mostly clear, but by dawn tomorrow morning we're going to start to see some clouds rolling in. It's from this clipper system. It's going to be pushing eastward and tracking to the north of us. That could actually give us a passing rain or snow shower tomorrow evening or night. Let me time it out for you. So lots of sunshine across New England today. Notice by tomorrow morning some extra clouds. A few scattered snow showers to the north of us during the day tomorrow. And then as a cold front approaches, we're going to see that chance for a quick little rain or snow shower overnight Tuesday and long gone by early Wednesday morning and Wednesday afternoon. will be a day with mostly sunny skies. Here's the seven-day forecast. So pretty quiet week ahead. That evening shower on Tuesday. Tuesday highs in the lower 40s during the afternoon, but with a lot more cloud cover than what we're going to see for today. Wednesday, a nighttime rain or snow shower that'll be clearing out early on Thursday morning. Back to the chilly air for Thursday and Friday. Looking ahead to the weekend, right now, potential to be unsettled. Right now, favoring more rain than snow, but we'll keep you in the loop on that.